Has. Just behind his right shoulder is the longtime trainer who has been with him. 65 prize fights already on his professional dossier for the man called the big. There's a weakness in what Barrera starts out with his jab. Rocky Juarez fires a wide left question in the mind of everybody yesterday. Who wins the jabbing contest early? So far, uh, stiff jabs. But for the most part, Juarez is doing a very good job of getting away from a lot of the punches. Rocky. Which is why Barrera. Good jab by Juarez. Stuck it right into the mouth of Barrera. And now Barrera. And as Larry alluded to, as I mentioned earlier, brilliant at close quarters, particularly in his three fights against Derek Morales. And there you see what. As a matter of fact, he might have a slight edge in some of those exchanges because he's, he's a much very wise. He's keeping to get in that zone again where he can punch it and punch and hand over the top, glancing blow. But Juarez got it onto the chin of Barrera. And there's a good left hook by Juarez to create distance. Now there's blood coming from the nose of Mark Wayne. Might have won the round for Rocky. Obviously, we'll be bringing Harold Letterman's scorecard a little bit later. He's punching more accurate, and he's catching punches very good. And so now, Ber the result of good, hard inside punching. There's a terrific body shot with the left hand by Ber Now Barrera trying to steal the round, and he gets ripped by a left hook. Barrera off balance as he goes into the ropes. Yeah. Fights. That's round three. Rocky Juarez did just that. He got aggressive. Didn't let... Yeah, but they're losing. Uh, the momentum of the fight turning towards Rocky. So now he's stepping it up. Dance. Yeah. Rocky, Rocky, Rocky. Marco, yeah. Marco, Marco. You have a Mexican crowd and two men. 3 1996. Another sizzling right hand over the top by Barrera, who has. What happened at the end of the last round? So sad. <laughs> These guys are punching the other guys. Was more like trying to go for a decision. The hitter was oh. going for a decision. These guys are going for. Ended big shots from time to time, and certainly almost knocked Barrera down at the end of the. a free, gentlemen. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Come off with the right hand of the body. Left and right up there. Juarez lands it. Boxing and dominating, so he changed up and then he starts going with the forward. Barrera getting going with the left hand, lands a left. Juarez doesn't snap him with a left hook. And Barrera obviates that by firing his own punches. The round are exactly the same as for the fourth to maintain a tactical control while staving off a stiff challenge so far. Juarez, blood streaming from his left nostril. Barrera keeps firing the jab. Juarez, Juarez explosive and Barrera ducking the right hand there. Good uppercut inside by Barrera. Side to take his chances on trying to take some of the steam out of Juarez. And now we've got a prize fight breaking up. It's the sheer activity of the older fighter still amazing to see him fight on this level of competition 10 years when he was fighting 10 years ago and steady and he, the momentum keep changing. Barrera's mouthpiece is out yeah. as he and Juarez go toe-to-toe -to -toe. and without a mouthpiece. The belt line, the way Harold Letterman described it. Hard right hand over the top. Vest body punching in the, in the first. And as you said later, Jim, he actually won the last round by four. He loses his punching power as the fight goes on either. Unlike a lot of we think he is, whether this has been really hard on him because he's been fighting. Where Marco is basically like concerned with trying to win a decision now. It's that did against Del Oya down the stretch. Late rounds. Yeah, and, and particularly in Las Vegas, they really like you to finish strong. This round could be stealable for Barrera, although what? Good body shot by Barrera. Juarez felt it. Do you well, think Barrera underestimated Rocky Juarez? To some degree, and I, I said I ain't doing a darn thing, and Rocky's winning these late rounds. Look at this. He's the definition of a young, strong guy going after the older guy. And Juarez lands an up. And the most effective punch still for the most part has been the jail. Good right hand. And the things he liked Barrera so much about watching his career was that he had... Back to his right and lands a right hand. Juarez over the top of the right, right hand. That Close round, both guys with power shots. There's another huge left hook. Barrera in the center of the ring, where he's got to try to stay away from Juarez's left hook. A good fight, but he should have a little bit more intensiveness in his punching now. He should be a little bit more. Juarez against the ropes, goes back to the body, got away with one on the belt line. Juarez knocks him backward. Good 
Body shot by Barrera. This is the brawling Barrera now. Four punch combination by Barrera. And the Morales fights, but it just right. He's stronger now than he did in the second and third rounds. Just be a total animal. Don't try to be too intelligent. Do a lot of pushing, bumping in with your shoulder. Barrera's the one who's had 65 fights. Juarez with two huge right hands. But you're going to stop of it. Uses the jab to pop Juarez back. Lands a straight right hand. Shows the kind of punishment he has seldom, if ever, taken. He'll be looking tired and rest for what. He still is landing the punches for the most part. He'll be trying for the knockout. Who may be beaten by one of the greatest of all time. Very, very good fight. With Bella Oya Mosley won. Lennox Lewis against Vitaly Klitschko. Juarez looking the fresher of the two fighters as he walks around. A three-way split. This bout is a draw.